our Supervisor of Fine Arts and World Languages, Mr. Dave Earhart, Supervisor of Social Studies, Dr. Alicia Ozer, and I also want to give a very special thank you to the members of our Veterans Day Committee for making today a reality. That includes Mrs. Bar Mr. Donald Sontag couldn't be with us, but he would have been here uh, with Danny Locke and Samantha. Um, he was in the Air Force from 1950 to 54, both active and inactive duty. And like many young men and women, he joined the military for financial reasons, but took pride in being able to serve his country. Sergeant Bob Gilroy, who's Caitlin Gilroy's father, served in Vietnam War as part of the United States Marine Corps from 1968 to 1972. He was stationed in the Quang Tri province at the, I'm sorry if I pronounce this wrong, uh, Hue Viet base. The climate is much different than in Pennsylvania. He can recall seeing different animals like the water buffalo while living there. celebrate the peace after the First World War. Years later, it was changed to Veterans Day as a way of honoring all veterans from all the wars that had taken place. Yeah. 